Hey, what's up, everybody? Uh, my name is uh, Murders Row 27. It's dedicated to um, my my favorite sports team, the New York Yankees. And um, hopefully I do a good job with this video, but I'm just trying it out and whatnot. But I just want to uh, express my opinion about the whole um, Jacoby Ellsbury situation. Um, I am so damn glad that this mofo is up out of there. I, I, never, I never wanted them to sign him in the first place. Um, even back when they um had even even back when they decided uh not to resign, well when they tried to resign Robinson Cano and they wasn't able to do that, so they had went out and signed Fieldsbury Boy. That's that's what I've been calling like ever since he was a Red Sox. Uh, ever, ever ever since he was a Red Sox, I didn't call him Fieldsbury Boy because I think he's soft, and he ended up being soft anyway, with his only one good year having ass. Um, I never understood like why they gave him that big contract anyway i mean like you seen the red Sox, they didn't they didn't even want to resign his ass because they knew that they had mookie Betts, you know like uh behind behind the curtains you know like he was basically um develop, developing in a minor league system so that's why they didn't resign jacoby ellsbury ass it's like once they seen that the steinbrenners and brian cashman threw money at his ass they was like well you know what we're not going to resign him we're going to let we, we're going to let him you know go, go to you all so you so you all can see how 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 not so good he he's actually is so they fucked up and signed him to this big ass contract to where like now you know even though he's off the team they still might have to pay him uh 26 million for next year but they're trying to have it to where like they won't have to do that but honestly i feel like that that was the one major fuck up that the yankees then made uh in this decade is uh is giving him that big ass contract and and is them signing him i never i i, I swear i never wanted them to sign Jacoby Ellsbury because I never I mean he only had one good year like I don't really know like you know um I mean I've seen his stats and everything even before he became a Yankee like he he only had one good year and that was like I think like what 2012 or 2011 or something like that and that was it like I never understood like why you know he got a big ass contract in the first place and like I say and like that's that's the reason why Boston didn't mind getting rid of his ass because they had Mookie Betts that's why. So, um, yeah, I'm just happy that um, the Yankees had finally decided to let his ass go. Um, you know, hopefully uh, they finally do some shit this offseason because I feel like that, you know, we basically, um, well, my team, not we, but my team is basically, you know, like that step away of being a dynasty again. And uh, But hopefully, you know, we uh, resign Didi and whatnot. But I, I explain all that later on. In my, in my other videos that I'm planning on doing it, this one uh, does well. So, um, once again, my name is Murders Row 27. That's dedicated to um, the Yankees' lineups throughout the history of their uh, championship teams, um, you know, which is loaded as shit. Uh, Hall of Famers off the wazoo, you know. So, um, you know, hopefully this video does a good job, and hopefully, you know, I uh, bring in other... How can I say it? Like other, I guess, um, other uh, other Yankee fans that have as much as kind of, as much common sense as, as I do, you know, like not those dumbass, ignorant ass Yankees fans um, that you might see periodically, you know, like every now and then they want to come in and think they know shit about baseball and whatnot, and they and they seen that because I'm a I'm a uh, basically a, a male of color that they'll be like, oh, you know, you don't know shit about baseball and blah 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 blah. It's like. Yeah, I know a nice amount about baseball. Like I know I know a nice amount about sports in general, let alone just baseball. So, um, yeah, I'm just happy that Jacoby Ellsbury ass is, is gone now. And um hopefully they won't have to pay his ass the twenty six million. They might have to pay him the twenty one million uh this next season. So you know, it is what it is. I just hope that, you know, we could possibly, you know, do do some shit this off season and then, like, you know, I, I will say this though before I, you know, go the, go into further detail. I just hope that if anything, like we can re we can resign Didi, you know, like if, if we if we want to bring, if they want to bring anybody else back, I mean, I wouldn't mind them bringing back Pentances. I feel like that they should. Honestly, I feel like that they should bring everybody else back. I just feel like that we need to like just add a piece to the team, you know, and that's it. Of course, every of course every every Yankees fan know what that piece is. Gary Cole, obviously, but I'm going to explain all that in, in a different video. But um, this video, I just want to say, like, I'm so glad that you, that Jacoby Ellsbury ass 
is not a Yankee no more. I never really want, I never wanted him to be a Yankee in the first place. I would have rather them sign Cano at the time than to give Jacoby Ellsbury that big ass contract. I would have rather him stay with Boston, but of course Boston, you know, they kind of they kind of outsmarted us with they, they kind of outsmarted our team with that uh, with that situation because they knew that they had Mookie Betts in the fold. So that's why they didn't. So that's why they didn't care about the Yankees signing his ass. But other than that, though, um, I'm basically uh, signing out, and um, hopefully this video does a good job. You know, um, what's your opinion? You know, I wouldn't. I don't mind reading you guys' opinions at all. So, uh, thanks.